Hello guys, welcome to another video. I hope you all doing great. Um, in this video, I'm going to give material to the living room and to the kitchen of this building by using floor generator. It's a powerful tool to create floor easily and so fast. So I'm going to use that. Um, but before creating our lines, um, make sure to turn on the snap tool here and make sure to turn on the end point and the midpoint we we're gonna use them and now we can draw our lines from this corner this is our entrance of the building so we leave it alone This is our kitchen. I want to give the wood to the kitchen too. This is the space between the rooms and the bathroom. So I'm going to give the wood to this space too. I'm gonna close my spill line as you can see I have my um, line here I will drag it and put it on the ground now we can open our floor generator so I'm going to give actual size of wood to my floor generator this is not what I want I will give 100 and about 60 to 25 for a spide as you can see we have our floor here but I'm gonna need to change around here so this option is for the height of my wood I will give this about one centimeter this is for the edge of our wood I believe two millimeters is good and for the space between our woods I will make it mm, zero so as you can see we create we created our woods our floor it's in the kitchen space between the rooms and our living room okay so now I'm going to give material to my floor I simply open the material editor by clicking on M on keyboard so I'm going to name it wood floor wood map. Um, this I believe is good. So what I'm going to do, I usually make bump texture out of the actual texture, but uh, now because of the time I won't do it I will use the actual texture for using it for the bump here but you don't have to do this you make the bump out of the actual texture so I will put it here and make it about 10 Now I'm going to give reflection to my wood. Around here I guess it's good. And make its glossiness to about 81. Yeah, it's good. So um, I'll leave it that way. 
I will give this to my floor and now as you can see we have to turn our texture it's it's not it's not right this way I will go to texture This is good. Yeah, it's good. And here it is. Here it is our floor. I'm going to take a render and show you the result. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you all having a good time. And I hope this was useful for you.